All right, hey everybody, welcome back to another video. And on today's video, I'm gonna show you what I did for the 4th of July. Well, at least part of it. And that's coming up right after this. Hi everyone, welcome back to Just Justin. I am Justin and I thought I did an intro for this video, but I totally spaced it off. So I'm gonna show you what I, what I did, just part of it. So, so I'm gonna toss it over to my past self. Take it over, past Justin. All right, so it's July 2nd and I am here at the Stadium of Fire here in Provo, Utah at the home of the BYU Cougars. Let's take a look. Alright, so Tim McGraw in the fire tonight starts about eight o'clock so that's what we're doing here and then we'll head back up camping All right, so it's almost 8 o'clock right now, and my wife's buying a t-shirt from Tim McGraw. We've already seen him in Arlington, so I'm not too excited, but let me show you something. So that green thing right there, that's where the trailers are for Tim McGraw, Marie Osmond, all the performers and stuff for tonight. And they have a no video and no photography sign. So, yeah. Last year I was videotaping over there and taking pictures and stuff, but this year, oh heck no. So I guess Tim McGraw doesn't like his picture taken or video of him. But he's a performer, so he sees that all the time on the stage. So this is how you order food at the BYU Stadium for some venues. You scan it and you order it. So this plane right here, it comes in later on in the video but it just keeps circling around the stadium just keeps circling around and around and around i was thinking what the heck but it comes to play later on
Parachuters are cool. They came in. Some of them came in strong. Some of them came in light. I mean, it was cool. They are a class act. I yeah, they're a force to be reckoned with, both in the air and on the ground. So Tim McGraw, he comes out on stage all strutting like he's the man, and he put on a pretty good show. I mean, I probably will get some copyright violations on this, but let's take a look and let's listen to what he has to say. All right, so we saw him in Arlington, Texas, with along with his wife, um, Faith Hill. And we were up in, I don't know, like the 20th row on the south side of the Dallas Cowboys Stadium. And this time my wife got up kind of close. And to see him, she was not, she was kind of happy. And so this right here, the they had um, sign language um, people doing ASL for the deaf uh, people in the audience. So that was kind of cool. They were um, signing Tim McGraw's songs. And so, yeah, he put on a pretty good show. These are just some pictures. I have a lot more clips of him 
singing, but copyright violations, you know, if Tim wants to give me copyright access, hey, I'll go for that. But yeah, he put on a good show. My wife was totally happy with that. And he wore those tight pants and he had to go change because he ripped his pants when he bent down like that. <laughs> yeah, my other son and I, we were sitting back in our seats. <clears throat> we had VIP seats. We were just sitting back there. We were just, you know, chilling and relaxing and listening to Tim McGraw sing away. I'm not the biggest fan, but hey, it is what it is, right? I So um, Tim McGraw said, light it up. And so people took out their phones and turned their flashlights on and was waving it back and forth. This is when he started singing um, Humble and Kind. This is actually a good song. I actually really enjoy it. I didn't think I would, but he actually sings a good song. And so I did a second loop around the stadium because more people joined in. And it, it was kind of cool that people, you know, would do this for him because this was a great song. And it made the stadium look kind of cool. And, yeah, of course, there's another picture of Tim McGraw right there. And my wife's going to kill me for showing you this picture. But she was, yeah, happy to see Tim McGraw. Yep. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to see if I can kind of talk over this so the music's not too loud. But this is the second performing act of the night. Well, Marie Osmond was first, Tim McGraw was second. So I guess it's technically the third. But she was amazing at that violin. I mean, that was amazing. The fire show, the dancing. That was that was a cool, pretty cool ep epic. Um sight they did a really good job and yeah i wish i could play the violin like she can so let's see if we can listen in on the some of the music mm -hmm. 